there's a brand new feature inside the Riverside Studio called Presentation Recorder. This feature will allow you to upload a Keynote file, PowerPoint file, or PDF, and you can save those in their studio. They'll be there until you remove them, and then you can present those slides during a recording. You'll get an individual video recording track of those slides you presented, plus all of your guests and participants. They also get their own separate recordings, video and audio. Let's check out the new presentation recorder. Here at the bottom of the screen, you'll see the share button. You can still share your screen like you did before, an individual tab, a window, or your entire computer screen, or you now have the option to upload a presentation. If it's your first time using this feature, you'll see the upload box, and if you've uploaded previous presentations, those will live here in this particular studio. You can upload a PowerPoint, Keynote file, or PDF file. Here I have a PDF of 16 by nine slides that I'm going to upload. You'll see the upload progress there in the window. And once it's uploaded, you're ready to play this presentation and everyone in the recording, your guests and participants, will see the slides. Keep in mind, any animations within a slide or transitions between slides will be removed if you upload a Keynote file or PowerPoint file. We recommend if you're trying to play a video to use our media board, you can check out that video at the link above or below in the description. Now, if you've built in animations like additional bullet points within a slide and you would still like to be able to do that in Riverside, you can export a PDF with each stage of builds separately. I'll show you how to do that in Keynote. Here in Keynote, I can go up to the File menu and then go to Export to PDF. In my Export window, check this box that says Include Each Stage of Builds. Then you can hit Next and then save this PDF to your computer. If you had animations or build in and outs inside an individual slide, you'll now have PDF pages per build and you'll be able to scroll through those inside the Riverside Presentation Recorder. Now to see it in action, I'm gonna start a recording here in my Riverside Studio. And now that I'm recording, I'm gonna go down to the Share button and then Presentation. I'll click the presentation I previously uploaded. And now I'm presenting my slides in this high quality 16 by nine format. All of the guests and participants can see the slides and this is being recorded as that separate video track as well. If I hover with my mouse over the slide, I can jump to a different slide. If I need to go back to the beginning or jump to the end, or you can use the left and right arrows on your keyboard to scroll through the slides. When I'm ready to stop presenting, I can put my mouse in the top right and click stop presenting there, or I can click stop here in the bottom toolbar. If you forgot to upload your presentation before recording, that's okay, you can still upload even after the recording starts. Just hit the plus button next to your presentations, choose your document, and then upload. You'll see the progress, and then you'll be able to present it during the recording as soon as it finishes uploading. Remember, you can preload these presentations before you record, and they will stay in this studio, whichever studio you've uploaded presentations to, until you remove them. If you have a duplicate or you'd like to remove an old presentation, hover your mouse over the thumbnail and click the minus button, and then you can delete the presentation. If I go to the recording from this studio, you'll see I have a separate track for my video and a separate track for the presentations, and I can download that in high quality. I can also use the Riverside editor to put it all together. I can choose a full length clip and I can export a full length clip with my own video and the presentation slides in full 16 by nine layout. You can also use one of our AI options, which will put the live speaker in picture in picture as you present. When you're ready to save this finished video file, you can hit the export button, export up to 4K video, normalize audio so everything is the same volume, and then click export. Our new presentation recorder is a great way to present slides and keynotes to your guests, participants, and get it recorded. You get a separate video track for your slides, plus video of every participant. If you'd like to learn more, check out the links in the video description, and don't forget to subscribe to the Riverside YouTube channel. We have lots of content on the best USB mics, how to build a video podcast setup, and a ton more. Thanks for tuning in. We'll catch you in the next video.